Hello guys, I hope you're all well. Today I'm going to be talking about how to purify your home. Now, if you've been following me for a while, you'll know that I am very much about having a clear space and a clear mind and how the two go hand in hand. But I've always been more focused on decluttering and organising and more the physical objects in the space rather than the air. I never really thought about the air and its impact on our well-being, the air in our home anyway. I kind of always just thought, you know, as long as your home is clean and you're not really using toxins, you know, I use all natural cleaning products and beauty products and stuff like that. I just assumed that my home would be purified from that alone. But for this video, I have teamed up with Pure Essential, who are a family-based aromatherapy laboratory, and they have created over 280 products that are based on pure and organic essential oils. So they really draw from nature to provide products for our well-being. And they commissioned a report called Air and Now, which was all about indoor air pollution. And honestly, it's not something that I'd ever considered. I know about outdoor air pollution, but I just assumed, like I said, if my house is clean and I'm not using, you know, any toxins, then I wouldn't have any indoor air pollution. But from their research, they found that levels of air pollution indoors were much higher than outdoors. And with millions of people suffering from respiratory conditions such as asthma and chronic obstructive pulmonary disease and so many more suffering from short-term ones like coughs and colds and hay fever, there's more evidence to show that poor air quality inside is a growing factor in these respiratory conditions. And obviously as a mum, I find that really concerning. It's just, it's really got me thinking about purifying the air in my home. I thought I'd share with you the ways that I am now making sure that the air is purified in my home. So number one, I have been using the Pure Essential Purifying Air Spray. Now this has 41 essential oils. It's antiviral, antifungal, antibacterial. It smells really fresh, minty, earthy. It's just, it's such a lovely combination of essential oils. I am a big, big fan of essential oils, which I will talk about a little bit later as well. And with this, you can either do targeted use. So you'll spray it, maybe six to eight sprays in the four corners of a room and then leave the room for 30 minutes while it kind of works its magic. Open the windows, let the air flow out. You can also spray it onto carpets, curtains, sofas, mattresses. And what it does is it tackles the three main triggers for respiratory symptoms, which are airborne bacteria, fungal spores, and house dust mites. And in the lab test, the results from spraying it directly onto carpet, mattress, fabric, was that it killed 100% of dust mites within the hour and no dust mites hatched for seven days following the spray on there, which I just think is amazing considering it's all natural essential oil based. And in turn, they did a study of 53 patients who had had long-term respiratory conditions. And after four weeks use, the patients had had significant improvements in their lung function. So yeah, I just think this stuff is absolutely amazing. Number two is to open your windows, let the air flow through your home. I know it's harder, like at the moment it's winter, it's cold, so you don't particularly want your house to get cold um, and you don't want your heating to leave the house, but it is really important. Even if it's just for a few minutes, I tend to do it in the mornings. So I'll wake up and I open my bedroom windows. I don't have the heating on until I've gone downstairs and turned it on. So I know that I'm not wasting the heating. And then I just leave the windows open just for a few minutes while I'm like making my bed and maybe getting my clothes out and stuff like that, just to kind of cleanse and purify the room a little bit. And I think that's a really, really important one to do. Number three is to have lots of plants in your home. There are particular plants that are really good for purifying the air. Ones like English ivy, aloe vera, spider plants. You would need to have a lot of plants in your home for it to fully purify the air, but every little helps. And I just think plants are very calming and beautiful. Number four, as I mentioned earlier, is to have essential oils in your home. I've got an essential oil humidifier and I just put a few drops in that and it just 
fills the home. And that's it, those are my ways for purifying your home, just making sure that the air is lovely and clear and fresh, just like your space and just like your mind. But yes, I hope that you have enjoyed this video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. I'll leave a link below to Pure Essentials so that you can go and check out their products and definitely, definitely try the purifying air spray because just the smell is lovely and the results are just incredible. So yes, thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.